Hey guys, we're out here today at the University of Guelph Research Farm in Alora, Ontario, and today we're helping them with the corn silage harvest. They're currently running an 8200i self-propelled forage harvester, and then have a few 7Rs with the Command Pros on the wagons. Today they're actually running some um, higher end technology running machine sync, um, using the external antenna on that harvester. It's using Wi-Fi to control that um, wagon tractor so that the operator and the chopper can control nudging him forward and backwards and left and right. We also have out here Julia from John Deere. Maybe Julia want to introduce herself. Thanks Graham. So I, I've been out here on, on the camera a few times talking about this harvest lab. So thanks for having me out. I like to stick close to this harvest lab technology. So previously we were talking about this sensor and its capability in a tabletop mode where we had fermented feed and we were doing a real time feed analysis once it's fermented from that bunk. And we are also looking at that harvest lab on board a drag line. Uh, if you remember looking at what it can really capture in real time as, as far as the manure goes. What we have today is on board this 8200i harvester, we have that harvest lab 3000. So it's mounted on board the spout of our harvester. And what it's doing is in real time, we're looking at the moisture of that corn silage. We're actually able to adjust the speed of the feed rolls so that we're tied into that moisture as that changes throughout the field. And that really gives us that extra compaction that we're looking for as that feed is traveling down the road to that bunk. Another thing too is we talked about these extra ingredients that are so important and we're actually able to create a yield map today with that harvester looking at our corn silage, the dry matter, we're looking at our starch, we're looking at our crude fiber, our acid detergent fiber, neutral detergent fiber, um, ash, and UNDF. So getting all of those same benefits but looking at it now from a yield basis so we can, we can really document what's happening from a field level. So that's at Harvest Lab 3000 on that self-propelled forage harvester and excited to be out here today. Falls upon us, hey Graham, we're it already sure chopping is. corn. <laughs>